There's just so many people that absolutely hate themselves. I like pretend all narcissists. Yeah, you know, they they hate themselves, or else they wouldn't do what they do. Yeah, you know, all the fucking drug addicts. That they're the one girl stopped doing drugs. I wouldn't know because I'm not around her twenty four seven. The one I talked to for four months, I I wouldn't know at all. How would I know? Like. But she, out of her words, she quit. Well, she's really messed up. Thinking I attacked her. But all these people that say, oh, well, I get no help. I get no help. Well, that was, you know, that's the world you live in. The world is set up that way. That victims don't get. Where can a victim go? Where can a poor person go? Where I'm at right now. The shelters are full. They make no sense. It's like, what? Your shelter's full. Don't you have a, like, a, anywhere? A warehouse with, you know, supposed to be, you know, 211 is supposed to assist you, and there is no assistance. Like, you know, you call up, and you're like, well, the only place I see is Lancashire Mission. Oh, well, they're full? Okay, um, can't place you anywhere. There's no... No shelters in Ephrata, there's no shelters in Mannheim that I know of, there's no shelters, you know. That's really sad. It shouldn't be that hard for the homeless at all. And then that's why women put up with insane abusing men. You know, like, they have nowhere else to live. I'd rather just live in the street. Instead of, you know, like, But, whatever. Hopefully, um, I'll be okay. Uh, it just kind of hurts, like, a little bit. I mean, I'm not, like, best friends with that hamless girl or anything, but, you know, it, we get, cl you get close to a person, and then they totally backstab you. Like, oh my god, just like Tasmanian Devil 2. It's like, what the hell, man? I never do it. I didn't do anything wrong with these people. I was just, unfortunately, I got involved. And look what happened after I got involved. They they just turn on you. They're insane. God. There's so many psychotic, um, really, really crazy women where, because they were traumatized, you know, sexually, um, two women that I met last year. They flirt like hell, right? I mean, they were abused sexually, so they flirt the child molested. They flirt like hell. But then when a guy actually comes close to them, they have their, they bring out their knife. What are you doing? Like, what? You flirted with me? Like, you, you're... You're coming on me, like, you know, um, the one homeless guy, um, held himself very well. I mean, he's like a big mountain man, you know, so he, he was able to fend off this little tiny thing, but he had to be alert. I mean, he, she could have stabbed him, like, if he was out drunk or something like that, she would have had a, a moment in time, you know, I mean, that situation could have went sour, you know. Um, if you're out of, out of it, um, that's crazy that you can't work out your trauma of being, you know, that's what happened to, to them. Um, Lorraine Bobbitt did nothing wrong because she was continually attacked. Her story makes sense because she's raped and uh, violated, uh, she's violated that way and beat up. And put down every single day for five long years. So it made sense what she did. Which is un unbelievable, but... And he just gets a sewn back. You live in hell. She, she, he got a sewn back on and does porn. And did porn. He died. I don't care when he died. But guess who cared about him? Who do you think cares about an abuser? Abusers. Pretend not narcissists. He, oh, Lorraine Bobbitt just wanted a green card 
And I think she made $18 million. Well, do you think she deserved the $18 million that she got after, you know, almost dying five years from this man? I don't know any of her other abuse in, in her life. Everyone's abused growing up somehow. But, I mean, that man alone probably abused. She got the worst abuse of any other person. He chose her just like. Pretend like narcissist chose me. I don't know why he chose me to fucking, you know, traumatize the dead. I don't know. I mean, I, he's, he's a joke. 2020, our Thanksgiving was a joke. What, what fun did I have with him? How did I make out like a bandit like he says? I, I was forced to order. I didn't have to order. I was just being nice. Churches, you know, I'm calling up to see what church brings food, and one did. And he got one that had bones in it, and, and almost choked to death. <laughs> oh, my God. And then he had to follow me all the way to my son's house to see if he was there. And I, you know, I have nothing to do. Uh, I could walk better in 2020. And uh, he had to follow me. He had to follow me. Oh my God. What for? Why? So he could fucking attack me when I, I greeted somebody happy Thanksgiving. Because, you know, I, I was his favorite victim. So he drained. I was his life supply. And he got all this great energy from me. And here he made me want to die all the time. I mean, my God, why wouldn't you want to die? Like, trying to get away from him. He follows you a mile. I mean, trying to maybe, maybe my son's home. Maybe he's not. I don't know. I just have to get away. Greet somebody. Greet a family. Greet a family. Happy Thanksgiving. The insane abuser has to... Wait till no one else is around. We had to walk a block away. Why did you? What did you say? You don't know those people. What do you think you're doing? That's because he wants me to be as miserable as he is. He hates himself, so he, he's bringing me down to his hell, all the way down. I mean, I, you know, I can't help it. Pretend a narcissist was a total asshole to me. You know, I, like, whatever. You know, I have to say the truth. I'm, I, I, like, can he be honest? Like, what one good thing happened Thanksgiving Day? Nothing. I mean, I might have seen him. I don't even saw my kid for, like, five minutes. Right? <laughs> That's a little nutcase. Follow me around. Oh, my God. And like, he made things so difficult for me. He locked me out of his place, and I didn't know. I, I had a phone, and I could have called him at any time, anywhere, and he could have opened up that door for me. But he was a control freak, and he made me, you know, he pretended that, you know, he was going to lock me out one time when he followed me all the way to for me to talk to Alex one time. I, um, he wasn't where I told him to wait, and I might have been 10 minutes late, so, well, now you're out for the night. I, I mean, that's how evil, he's, he's just totally evil for, to me, in 2020. Well, now you're out for the night, you know, uh, I said, okay, well, I'll let you in, but you, you have to behave. You have to learn how to, to, um, get along and behave. When he's never behaved like one second around me. Yeah. But with like badass grandma buying her a, a sub. And we did not want him to buy us a sub. We did not want that at all. Oh my God. We, we just had to get a bathroom. We were just thinking, no, I took a picnic. We can get food at the picnic. Yeah, just like, what can we do? And I was like, well, we have to get a bathroom. Okay, well, downstairs, you can get a bathroom down there. And, um, and, um, 
could tell on narcissist players. Well, he had to complicate things and say, well, do you want to go out to eat the subway? And I'm like, what? I don't, no, we don't want anything from him. So we went to the bathroom and we said, um, someone's supposed to meet us here. And he pretended like he didn't have any money. And all of a sudden he splurred his one. We can get the most expensive subs. We can get a $30 sub if we want to. Like, what the hell? I mean, some subs you didn't get, like, close to $30, like $25. It was over a $20 sub. What the hell? I didn't have any money. And I was like, well, you can get whatever you want. A large sub. And I was like, man-ass grandma was really cool. I actually had four of them. Hmm. The one turned out bad. Stabbing, you know, anyone around. The other one, uh, from the mission, she was the oldest one. The other one got lost with her daughter. The other one's in the trailer park. So she's not really a badass grandma because she's just lonely and hates herself. She's not one of my badass grandmas. But I did call her that for a day. I'm like, whatever. <laughs> Make up whatever you want. So, um, we went to the bathroom, me and one of the badass grandmas went to the bathroom, right? And, um, she came, oh, oh, hi, is, is, is that who, that's just pretend, okay, are we going to eat, you know, are we, okay, well, we'll, we can all share you know, since you have no money, we, we don't expect you to get us anything. We'll, we'll just share a big, a large sub and you get whatever you want. And he went out of his way. He's like, no, 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 no. You order whatever you guys want. And he told me, you know, he thought I was going to die from smoking pot in the past. And he tells her, you know what? I was around a guy who was smoking pot and I got high off of the, the, the pot fumes and I really liked it. I, and when we left there, I said, you know, he, he, he's so awful. He's so fucking awful. I, you know, he, he, he attacked me forever for, for smoking pot. And, and, and he says this shit, comes up with this shit, being on his best manner. What the fuck? Where is it? Wow, you change up. Wow, you're fucking schizo. You're like, you, you have like how many personalities? Like, what the fuck? All you need is two personalities. And if, you know, you, you're in that horrible, horrible, insane abusing mood for your victim the majority of the time, it's just not worth it. All right, so, my God, we left. And he wanted to follow us. And like, no, no, no. We're just going to sit by the fountain. We want you to get away from us. Like, we, we didn't want you, you know, we just, we're going to maybe use your bathroom. And my God. And she's like, um, that's not the child molester you were talking about, is it? I said, yeah, it is. I know. How could you do that? I'm like, we were just going to use the bathroom. We were even going to. Talk, see him. There's a bathroom downstairs. <laughs> She's like, I can't believe you. you I can't believe you. you know, she was really mad at me. Like, oh, well, they're all over. I mean, what, what's the big deal? Like, you know, he, he knows who you're talking to. I mean, you don't know who you're talking to. Shit. All my friends are heathens, take it slow. Pop, pop, pop. <laughs> Wait for them to ask you who you know. Pop, 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 pop. Please don't make any sudden moves. You don't know the half of the abuse. <laughs> Yes, pretend a lot, narcissist. We all feel sorry for you. You are still you are abused to death. Now, if you could just get out of your fucking shit, 
You're emotionally stunted, asshole. Just get out of your fucking shit and be a man and uh, grow up and uh, man up to the hell that you create for yourself every single day. Giving away all your money is one. Who cares? I'm glad he's not in my life. He's, he's impossible to deal with, with for me. Now, pretend I'm not, I mean, Purple Alien God has the world that, that it's genderless. Purple Alien God has the world at its fingertip. He does it every single time, every single time. He has a bottomless uh, bank account. Whatever. You know, I, I never got a penny from him. Not a penny. He did give me a crumb, but he wanted me to sign over his life. And that was a sure. I, I thought, it's a crumb compared to all that she got. You know, I, I, don't, I have no idea. You know, he goes to the churches and lies. And she doesn't need, you know, he doesn't need any money. You know, but, you know like, whatever. I, it would be nice to never have to do anything and not have to work. And I, I mean, I worked by putting up with people and keeping my sanity. I mean, I, you know, it's work talking to homeless assholes. And guess what? I'm not going to talk to them anymore. I mean, they're just fucking that fucking far gone. Just forget the guy and the girl I, I could care less about. Who I became like close to. And he never, the guy never knew my story. He was in my brother's class. He never knew my story. I got close to him. Well, that's a mistake. Fucking asshole. Flirts with every, everything that comes down the path. And girls, he's not gay. He, he cares. And, and, and he disrespected me altogether. Wanted, wanted me to, to sleep on the grass with him when I have a bed that I'd sleep in. It's off. That's awful. That's total disrespect. That's like, like every asshole guy. Oh my god, that no guy ever gave me a penny in Leicester. Uh, uh, you know, they're just like really that far gone. Well, I'm good company. No, they're not. No, they're not. They're not. So I could care less. Yeah. They're uh, just total insanity what comes out of people's mouths and what, you know, what they actually do. Just, oh my God. It sucks that most people don't know what's going on. I, you know, it really does. Like, you know, I, I'm sick of, you know, it tires you out to try to explain to them an event that happened three years ago or or yesterday. Hey, didn't you remember that yesterday? Oh my God. Horrible.